Hello friends! My name is Alex and I'm from Education Galaxy. Today we will explore addition and subtraction, solving for the unknown. And for today's adventure, we are traveling to the Mathtopia Circus to meet Doodles the Math Clown. Why, hello everybody! My name is Doodles the Clown. I would like to show you the most spectacular circus Boys and girls, you will not believe your eyes. I introduce to you the amazing, the wonderful, the talented, Marvin the Magnificent Math Dog. Give him a round of applause, please. His amazing talent is that he can magically solve for unknown numbers in any addition or subtraction problem. And today, something special is about to happen. He is going to show you how he does it so that you can be wonderful, amazing, spectacular, and magical too. Come on, Marvin, show us your trick. Why, certainly. It's all about one little secret that no one, and I mean no one, knows about. I like to call it my bar model. It takes the idea that two parts make a whole. Think about it. If you have a whole cookie and you break it into two parts, those two parts make up the whole cookie. It's just broken. In other words, part one plus part two equals the whole. Let's try some examples. If one part is six and the other part is four, what do you think the whole is? Yes, ten, because six plus four equals ten. Okay, here's a trickier one. If we know the whole is 20, but we only know one part and it's 12, what is the other part? Well, you are looking for 12 plus what is 20. What do you think? Why, yes, it's eight. Okay, enough of these baby problems. You're ready for some harder ones. The circus clown has five trick flowers. He needs to have a total of 18 flowers. How many more flowers does the circus clown need? What is that? College algebra? It's so hard. That's impossible. You'll never solve that. Doodles, please. Watch how my trick transforms this problem into an easy peasy lemon squeezy problem. The secret? My bar model. Watch this baby work. I know the clown has five trick flowers, and the problem also tells me the total, 18. But do I know the part? No, we don't. This is terrible. How will we ever find it? Well, looking at our model, we see that five plus what is 18. We can use a fact family and use 18 minus five. What does that equal? That's right, 13. Oh. Come on, let's do another. The juggler is juggling some bowling pins. He dropped two and had five left. How many bowling pins did the juggler start with? Let's make a model. That's right. We know part of his pins were the two that he dropped and the other part were the five he had left. But we don't know what the whole was. Oh, so what minus two equals five? Yes. Or five plus two. That's seven. The answer is seven bowling pins. This is so easy. You got it. This is fabulous. Now we know how to solve for the unknown. I'm so excited. Remember, the key is your bar model. Okay, now I have to go tell everyone I know. See you later, Gators. And now that you know the secret, you can find any unknown in any addition or subtraction problem. Have fun practicing.